You can think of the edutronic as a microscope for time. When things happen in the blink of the eye, you can get tricked into seeing what you expect to see. Got him looking! And sometimes that's very different from reality. We provide the clarity and insight to tell the difference between your expectations and what's really going on. Uh, the Intratronic helps our athletes, whether it's hitters or pitchers, by filming their mechanics in high quality slow motion video. A uh, day in the life of the Edgertronic at Driveline Baseball is pretty varied, whether it's to film live at bats, uh, pitch design sessions, uh, pitching mechanics, hitting mechanics, and then we also have ones that are mounted on the wall that have uh, semi-permanent installations. Ah, uh, no. Oh, yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah, when we're breaking down edutronic film, say of a pitch design session, we're looking for rotation of the ball and the ability to connect the data from TrackMan or Rapsodo to the field for the athletes. So they actually see what's happening, uh, which has been a huge breakthrough because just showing them a bunch of data doesn't always resonate with them. So having high quality, uh, very easy to access video has been a breakthrough for a lot of pitchers in the big leagues today. Baseball player development is going to be pushed forward significantly by the Edutronic uh, because optical motion capture and computer vision is our, is our future in this game. So there's so much more to explore through computer vision and it's going to require very high frame rates and very high quality of video and the Edutronic is poised to capture that market so as much of an impact as it had today in 2019, uh, its best years are ahead of itself. The Edgertronic was intended to make high-speed video more affordable and accessible. Seven years ago, we certainly never would have thought that MLB teams would be buying our camera to up their pitching game.